you started off with that yes, no opposite game, and we went to the walk stop game that we just did. Let's let's talk about those two things. How were you how were you feeling? What was happening? I was confused. You were confused. Excellent. That was my plan. <laughs> Confuse you. So you were confused. Talk about that. Challenge. 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 Yes. Yeah. So will you say that again, nice and loud? Would you stand and tell the whole audience? <laughs> And it, it's like even, like I, I always take the seven trains to the bus, 
I just automatically do it. Somebody suggested that we take the Long Island Railroad. I thought about it. I was like, oh, that's, that's different. <laughs> I'll do it. <laughs> but I did it. It's better, right? So rather than just going through like the regular motions, rather than doing the same old thing, know that you have that, that ability to react in a way. I know you guys talked about it yesterday. People say a certain word to you, it triggers a reaction. Well, it doesn't have to, because you know that there's that nanosecond of confusion, there's that nanosecond where we can choose a different response. All right? Um, let's get some people up here. I had my, um, my iron front columns. Oh, there's some. Oh, there are. Thank you. So, now, in the, uh, Perhaps in the past, when, uh, when you were called to read something, you might be like me, or, uh, or yeah, or, or, like, um, or, or like Nikki, and we generally jump up, right? We generally jump up as people, right? Where can we all go? But um, you, you might also be somebody who in the past didn't jump up. But again, just like we were talking, now, uh, when your name is called, you have that nanosecond to sort of maybe break an old habit and become one of the people that jumps up, right? So there's going to be a stimulus when your name is called, and then your ability to respond to that as a brand new ASAP student with a brand new clean slate. There's a different, you, have a, you don't have to behave the way you used to. You don't have to say no to a, an opportunity that's healthy, all right? I'm not saying that you do that, but I'm just saying, again, this is, again, the stimulus is going to be your name and then your ability to respond, all right? Got it? So it's even with this, when you hear your, your name. Susan Stewart, Susan E. from, from uh, Trinidad, Trinidad, born in Trinidad. Is Susan here? She's not here. She's not here? All right. Um, uh, is it uh, U R W A? The last name is uh, yes. Come on. Up. Excellent. Very good. How do you say it? How do you say it? Arwa. Arwa. My daughter's name is Una, so it sounds. It's like it has that sort of similar feeling. Arwa. Una. Brenda. <laughs> the Yelena. All the ahs. All of the ahs. Liang Win. Lin. There you go. Excellent. Is it. Is it. Uh, the last name is Williams. Is it a, a, with an S T E? Sterling Williams, what a sterling name. <laughs> right? Um, and is it Giancarlo? Giancarlo. Giancarlo. Welcome. And Helena Maya. Uh, am I saying uh, uh, Helena. 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 Transparent Helena? Yes. <laughs> Midsummer Night's Dream. Right? Do you know that? Do you know that your name is in uh, the play by Shakespeare, Midsummer Night's Dream? No. You should read that play. You will love it. You will love it. Two, four, six, seven. Uh, Chris Car Car uh, Carasalo? Chris Carasella.
last week, and somebody said, and I was blown away, and I came in this morning and said, somebody said, oh, Erica did her poem yesterday, and it was even better than last week. I said, impossible. Because <laughs> it's impossible, because it was crazy good last week. So, uh, <laughs> actually, can we start, can we go left to right? I'm from the Lone Star State, where blue bonnets line our highways and wide open spaces, where yellow roses say yee-haw, where traveling across from one side of the state to the other feels like traveling the globe and takes about as long, where we are proud to claim we are Texans, or like I like to say, a Tejana with a Harlem heart. I am from Jeronimo de la Rosa Jr., yes, like the Apache warrior who never surrendered, and Ana Maria Rodriguez de la Rosa, Tia Francis, Tio Pablo, Tia Odi, primos, primas, abuelas, abuelos, no longer here. I am from Uno to the death, and imaginary friends, and imaginary performance spaces where I was the star. I am from tortillas de harina being made in the wee hours in the morning because we eat breakfast tacos with our coffees, not bagels. Or the quickie plate, two cheesy enchiladas with spicy meat sauce that you really only can get at home. Tender beef fajitas that melt in your mouth upon hitting in your tongue. A stack of warm tortillas de harina where in winter time you want to put it up to your cheek because it's nice and warm and soft. Refried beans, rice, and a Texas tea as big as your face. <laughs> I am from Mama and Daddy, mis hermanas Gabriela and Veronica, from Gabby and Juana, from Frida Kahlo, from Emma Tenayuca, from Cesar Chavez, from Gandhi, from Bob Marley, from my students, from Dr. Seuss, from everyday strangers because they are all extensions of me. I am from emancipate yourself from mental slavery. None but ourselves can free our minds. I am from, I can create anything I want or want to be because I live in that possibility. I am from Imakesh. If I honor you, I honor myself. If I respect you, I respect myself. And if I love you, I love myself. <laughs> I am from Ecuador, a uh, small town uh, called Cuenca. Uh, I am from uh, my grandparents, uh, Angel Pajal. Uh, they were the ones who raised me. Uh, I am from uh, a soccer ball, which I used to play with when I was a kid. Uh, I am from uh, yellow rice with uh, beans, vegetables, and chicken. Uh, I am from uh, my grandparents. They're the person that inspired me to keep going. Um, I am from uh, Friendly, uh, and I am from uh, Don't Waste Your Life, and I am from uh, You Have the Capacity to Accomplish Anything, as long as you have your right mindset. I am from Queens. I am from my mom, Adriana Norena, who raised me by herself and taught me everything that I know today, you know, how to be a good person. I am from Spider-Man. <laughs> I, am, I am from rice with chicken, and also black beans with rice, favorite. I am from my grandma who inspires me, who showed me that anything could be possible. She came here without nothing, and then she you know, she worked really hard and then she came here, she brought her family and then raised all of us. I am from humor and um, I'm from humor and just, yeah, just, just yeah. <laughs> And yeah, I don't know what else to say, so that's it. Beautiful city, which is now called the place of death. I'm from Queens, Barakoy, St. John's. 
hospital. I am from my parents, two parents. I'm from the game Crash. I'm from spicy chicken biryani with kabli palau with topping of nice sweet uh, carrots and raisins. I am from our holy prophet Muhammad and my father who inspires me to become a better person and to live my life to the fullest. I am from humor, love, humble. I'm from baby your firework, come and lay colors first. I'm from nothing is impossible because because the word impossible by itself means I am possible. <laughs> I'm from Flushing Hospital, a hot summer day. I'm from my mom and my dad. I'm from Super Mario World, passed out from dad. I'm from Sandwich with a glass of lemonade. I'm from dad, the man responsible for everything in the house. I'm from humor and understanding. I'm from chapter three, nostalgia and mannerisms. And I'm from always trying. I am from North Shore LIJ Hospital in Forest Hills, Queens. I am from Willetta Marie Williams that raised me as a single mother with my younger sister in a loving home. I am from Power Rangers Toys and I'm not afraid to say it. <laughs> uh, I am from Kanye West. I mean, my mother inspires me, but Kanye West inspires me musically and music is what's important to me. And I'm from, this ain't for ordinary people, don't compare me to rappers, I'm trying to be like the Beatles. And that's it. <laughs> I'm from a private, from, and located in southeastern of China. And I'm from a Danish family, raised both by my parents and grandparents. Um, I'm from, it was too young for me to remember what I loved when I was a kid. I from the water from water fountain. I'm from Kevin at time, one of my social study teachers who inspired me to work on to work to the best of my ability. I'm from my sense of humor. Um, I'm from a song named Wordplay, but I don't know if you've seen it. Mm -hmm. I'm from a supportive magazine. I am from the former Soviet Union, and I was um, raised in Brooklyn, and moved to Queens. My childhood games were like food, jump rope, Barbie, kitchen plates, sex, stuffed animals, and puzzles. <laughs> I see so much. It was a weird game. And my favorite meal was chicken, broccoli, with rice, and fruit punch. And my sister's is my sister's friend. She became very optimistic, and she's always she always has a smile on. And I learned from her. And um, my positive personality trait is patience, understanding. And my favorite song is about like from Alicia Keys, sitting with a broken heart. And Keisha Cole, take me away. Eminem, space bound, and Mockingbird. And my teacher once told me that you're a good person, so keep it up.
I am from Long Island, Huntington Hospital, Strong Island, Wine Edge, Eastern Long Island. I am from Foster Miller and Dorothea. I am from my skateboard. It was painted yellow, green, black, red, rip tape on the top with a shape like a fish and a kick tail on the back. I did an ollie before I knew what it was, and I would ride it down the mountains, down the hills of my mother's college campus, the trucks crossing the pavement, <laughs> with my socks pulled up to my knees like Michael Cooper. And I would dive towards the grass and roll because I didn't know how to stop. <laughs> I'm from, you know, fried chicken. Cook crispy on the outside, juicy on the inside. When you take a bite, it hits you in the eye. I am from <laughs> collard greens with vinegar, a little bit of salt. You smell them in the pot cooking all day long. I am from macaroni and cheese, elbow number nine. Five kinds of cheese, Havarti, cheddar, and whatever else is on sale. <laughs> I am from sweet potato pie, cooked in the graham cracker crust, sprinkled with coconut. Yeah. And after a food like this, a workout is a must. I am from my mom. You see, I rode the skateboard down the hill while she was in college because she had to leave school when she was eight to go pick potatoes on the farm. We're from Florida. So at eight, she left school, and she returned when I was 12 to get her degree in criminal justice. I am from where you are from. Mm -hmm. I am from whatever it takes in that moment to make someone realize that I'm human, just like them. I am from, it changes every day, but today it's Brother, 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 there are far too many of you dying. I am from America is safe in the hands of young people like you. I'm from North Sinai Hospital, Manhattan. I'm from my mother and father. I'm from my childhood to it being poking off a game board. I'm from my favorite meal, macaroni and cheese and steak. I'm from my father keeping me inspired to stay in high school and love to drive up. I'm from keeping calm and humorous attitude in tough times. I'm from I believe I can fly. I'm from keep your head held at all times. I used to make 
sugar cookies with sprinkles. I am from tilapia baked with Caesar salad dressing and salt pepper with brown rice and fresh green beans. I am from my pastor. He preaches the message of faith, love, and hope, and that there is life after death. I am from being passionate and honest, and I believe honesty is the best policy. I am from every day is sweeter than the day before. And inspires me to look forward to better days that I have to come. I am from, I am stronger than I was and I'm stronger. And I am stronger, oh, I am strong enough. You're doing great. Come on. Yeah. Yeah. Right. I cried yesterday. That was hard for me. I hate doing that. <laughs> but I did it. Now you got it. Go. We're here for you. Okay. I'm right here. Go. <laughs> And is now back traveling 
and pastoring and preaching and teaching, just like he used to before he went to the hospital. He's lost a lot of weight, too. He looks really good. <laughs> then I got a call yesterday that he went back into the hospital. Yeah. But he's coming out today. <laughs> he's coming out today. I am from I smile, even though it hurts if I smile. I know God is working, so I smile, even though I've been there for a while. I This is the way, that this empathy that you're feeling when someone gets up and shares is beautiful. You're sitting there, you're pulling for someone. This, yes? Like you said, like, that we're supposed to, yesterday they said that we're supposed to help each other graduate uh, 2013. So that's the same thing that we did now. We helped her. This is a this room is a safe place to try something new, to try something different. In fact, this room is really just a metaphor for your ASAP experience. In ASAP, you've got people here to support you, to help you get through, who are feeling for you, who want you to succeed. And so know that, that the ASAP program is a safe place and there are people here that, that are ready to support. They're ready to go. That's what they're here for. They're waiting for these moments where they can they can jump in and, and help you out. Alright? So 
that this is a, a safe place. And right now we're going to practice the song that we did yesterday, right? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Song is it? Yeah. 
her name is not Kimberly. He's saying so. Like, fresh kicks, his name is not fresh kicks, even though he's probably gonna have to live with that for the rest of his life. And he's while he's here at QCC, his name is Chris. Kimberell is the name of the singer that sang the song that she sang. So that's why I call her Kimberell. Just had to explain that. Okay, so Brianna. So let's find some. Uh -huh, not oh, yeah. Yes! 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 Okay. So at the end, where we do that, no. if I just spread my wings, I just want you to add them over there. I can fly, yes, I should fly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. Yeah. I don't want you to do it like that, okay? I want you to do it.
So we're going to begin in just a second. And before I was trying to see if we could fit into a circle. Now I know we can fit into a circle. So leave your stuff. Keep your iron crumbs with you. Come on up into our circle again. Let's restart. So we're going to, in just, in just a couple of minutes, we're going to have a celebration, a sharing of all that you have created these, you know, this day and a half, not even, these few hours that we've been together, that you've been together. And I, when I was reading the, the, the book, the, the Seven Habits, there is a quote that begins the chapter of uh, to be proactive. And this is the quote. It's from Henry David Thoreau. And this is the quote. I know of no more encouraging fact than the unquestionable ability of a person to elevate their life by conscious endeavor. I'll read it one more time. I know of no more encouraging fact than the unquestionable ability of a person to elevate their life by conscious endeavor. What do you think that means to you? What does it mean? Yeah, that, that's, that's one of the things that can slow you up, is that voice in the back of your head. And, and what this is saying is that, that if you consciously try, you can make things better, right? Anybody else? Yeah? Sure, one more time, here it comes, ready? Make sure you catch it. And if you don't, all right. The knowledge, I, I know of no more encouraging fact than the unquestionable ability of a person to elevate their life by conscious endeavor. Everything is unlimited. There's no limit to nothing. So your knowledge, there's no limit to your knowledge. All right. Anybody else? I got it. I got it. Yeah. Sure. Um, what it means to me? <laughs> it's that you can put your mind to something and you make it effort to think about it. Consider it. Think about it. Consider how you are moving forward in your life and what you're doing. That all things are possible. You move to another level of existence because you're putting your mind to it. Anybody else? You're in control. Just do what you know that you can do and more. Exactly. You're in control. Know what you can do. And what was the last question? And do more. And do more. Know what you can do and do more. These past days, two days, the, this is just a great metaphor for your your ASAP experience. And this, what we're about to do, is a very, very important part to these two days. And in a very important part to your ASAP experience. We've come this far. So many times in life, you see people, you, you've seen it, where people get all the way up to the finish line, and for some reason, they allow something to derail them. They allow something to knock them off course, and they don't they don't put the period on the end of the sentence. They don't finish. They don't blow through the finish line. So we're approaching the finish line to what, what you've been working on. It's now time to pick up speed and blow through the finish line and absolutely put closure and a period on the end of this. And think of this as a metaphor for your ASAP experience. You are going to go through these years here at Queensboro, and, and you're, going, you're going to move through. And whenever it gets difficult, think back to this, this moment right here. We're not done yet. We're still in the middle of it. And we have to complete it. We have to put closure on this. And this is a metaphor for your experience coming up. 
You've got to hang in there. You've got to do the thing. You've got to collaborate. You have to make these conscious decisions. And in the end, you've got to put closure on it. You've got to do close the deal. Do your best work. Do your best work. Do your best work. Absolutely. Does anybody have anything else that they would like to share before we light this candle? Anybody? No. Silence all cell phones. <laughs> Thank you very much. Shot. Silence all cell phones. It's on shot. It's on shot. It's on shot. Put it on stun. 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 And let's all come in the middle. Everybody come on in.
from Pakistan, Islamabad, Pakistan, Islamabad International Hospital. I am from my parents. I am from cricket. I am from fried chicken plus rice. I am from my parents. I am from forgiveness. And I am from You Are Not Alone by Michael Jackson. And I am from Do Hard Work Until You Get Your Success. And I was born in Flushing Hospital in Little Old Queens. Yeah, that's where I'm from. And my mama was my daddy. Yeah, that's where I'm from. The little, oh, shut <laughs> I shook the snot out my nose with that toy. <laughs> That's where I'm from. Crab legs and shrimp scan feet. Yeah, that's where I'm from. Perfect, but both of them. Preferably from Red Lobster. Yeah, that's where I go. <laughs> Grandma's ability to teach and hold my ground. Yeah, that's where I'm from. I'm a no-nonsense woman. Yeah, that's where I'm from. Look deep into their eyes and hypnotize. Yeah, that's where I'm from. Um, <laughs> I'll be missing you because that's from my favorite movie. Set it off. Yeah, that's where I'm from. Uh, keep in mind, oh, keep in mind that today will show tomorrow. Yeah, that's where I'm from. I'm from Queens, and I was born in Elmhurst Hospital. I'm from my mother, Isabel Tolentino, and was raised by her and my stepdad, Vladimir Valder, along with my three sisters, Ashley, Valerie, and Zyra. I am from Game Boy, Pokemon. I am from sushi. I am from shrimp, lobster, any type of seafood. That's where I'm from. <laughs> I'm from it is what it is. Cause like sometimes you need to learn to accept things. And I'm from you're smart. You can do it. Don't give up because you feel like you don't have it in you. And that's where I'm from. I am from Trinidad, where the Caribbean Sea and the Atlantic Ocean and cultures from the east and from the west meet and mix and combine and all become one, and one become all, and all become me. I am from my grandmother, Kanusa Kaleru, who was dancing from since before I was born, and who will probably die dancing, because that's what she does. And I am from a grandmother who still tells childhood stories that start with my past head. I am from a mother who thought that she was born into misfortune, and who I naively thought that all she had, or all she didn't have, was love and money, until I realized that all she had was love, and her greatest achievement is not hanging on a wall, but is standing in her QCC talking to you today. Oh. I am from my mom and my grandma's hot salad roti straight off the tower, <laughs> with country house butter and a big, thick hunk of Trinidad cheese, the greasy, cheesy one that would probably give my heart attack when I drink it. <laughs> I am from the wisdom of Buddha. I am from the ways of Gandhi. I am from the dream of Martin Luther King Jr. I am from the experiences of all the people before me. And I am from the strength of all the parents like mine who give up for children who are here trying to make their dreams come true. I am from country music songs that talk about life and that talk about whiskey two o'clock in the morning. <laughs> I am from sorry, 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 <laughs> and Bona Mana, and Norago, and anything from Super Junior because they're awesome. Yeah. <laughs> I am from my grandmother, always telling me to do my best and forget the rest. From my mom, always reminding me that put your trust in Jesus Christ and you can never go wrong. I am from 
from Dory from Finding Nemo. Uh -huh. Always singing, just keep swimming, just keep swimming. <laughs> Anytime she didn't know where she was going, because I will find her around going. I am from Forrest Gump, saying life is like a box of chocolates. You never know which one you're going to get. I am from Master Ugwe from Kung Fu Panda, saying that there are no such things as accidents, because everything happens for a reason, and that is why I'm here today.
Jessica Pamela Medreno, El Salvador, San Salvador. Marjorie Diaz, Columbia, Medellín. Catherine Navarro, Brooklyn, New York, Puerto Rico. Erika Lisa Gide, Rara Lato, Mexico Sur. Daniela Garcia, Cali, Colombia. Anna Maria Sanchez, Jamaica, Queens, New York. Adam Jose Soto, East Thomas, New York. Catherine Thomas, Historic Queens, Mexico. Susan Stewart, Glen Oaks, Port Trinidad, Port Spain. Kadia Gershu Gideshi, Shigonish, Trinidad and Tobago. Helena Mayne Paraku, Queens, again. Me being proactive is finding a job. Taking charge. You want to sleep early. Finishing things. Not holding grudges. Organizing my life. I pray. Bring up and see the positives. Making better choices. Finishing school. Don't waste my time. Be on time. Finally taking photography as a hobby. Staying focused and dedicated. Situation. Study hard. Growing up. Exercise more. Cutting down on Korean study time so I can get sleep. Getting my license. Being great for me is setting up for my family. Moving to New York. Seeing the girls. Attending college and finding new friends. Mental orientation by myself. Sacrifices. Helping my mom and dad everyone here. Finish high school. Performing in my high school basketball game halftime show. Performing in my school body. Talking to my half brother for the first time in my life. Going against my mother. Live my girlfriend. Studying a new life. Finally trusting friends. Supporting my home and time to go home. Taking care of a nine year old with a broken collarbone. Coming to New York. Not giving up in high school. My sister holding my back. All the dreams my mother gave up so I can keep my dream. My parents come into this country to have a better life. Sacrificing for my opportunity. My mother giving up everything so I can live my dream. Great grandmother getting married at 12 so she can have a better life. My mother giving up her life for me. Comforting my best friend for over 12 hours. My mom brought me here for a better opportunity in life. To my mom moving to America. My mom moving to America. My mom helped me pay tuition for the company. My father sleeping on the couch. My mother raising me in a single parent home along with me and my sister, working two jobs. Yeah. Parents leaving it all to give me and my brother a better life. Me, my mother, and my sister leaving my father for a better life. Mohammed Hollis, Queens, August 23rd, 2011. Catherine Marie Navarre, Brooklyn, New York, August 23rd, 2011. 
Mr. Carl Hortasia, Buenos Aires, Argentina, August 23, 2011. Luis Jose Hernandez, Omar Sweet, August 23, 2011. Kayla Jimenez, Queens, New York, September 23, 2011. Mr. Jose Hernandez, Omar Sweet, August 23, 2011. Mr. Jose Soso, Queens, 2011. August 23, 2011. Mr. I'm from Hainan I'm from Hainan I'm from Yuri Buak. 
I'm from Asian salad and white rice. I'm from one of my best friends in China who taught me how to learn to be a, a better person through reading. I am from understanding, honest. I am from responsible, diligent, kind-hearted. I am from yesterday once more. I am from St. John's Hospital in Queens. I am from Najib and Shaista. I am from N64 Mario. I am from my aunt Sozania. I am from my grandfather. I am from telling a joke. And I am from an eminent soldier. I am from Poland, raised in Brooklyn. I am from my mother and father, Isabella and Teddy. Uh, I'm from PlayStation 1. I'm from bacon, egg, and cheeses. <laughs> I'm from my aunt who always inspired me to be good in school. I'm from uh, being funny and making people laugh. I am from Lupe Fiasco. I am from Be All Can Be.
good genius home. She is the good. She is the friend. Hi, how are you? Hi. <laughs> Hi there. <laughs> What's your name? My name is Queenie. Queenie, nice to meet you. Would you like to drink anything? Eat anything? Juice, anything? Oh no, no. Thanks. Why you do? Why you bring your friend inside? You know nothing in, is inside the fridge, the serving. So why? Why do you care? <laughs> are you kidding me? <laughs> Listen, <laughs> I hope you cannot bring your friend because they're absolutely crazy. We're not What's your name? Hi, my name's Virginia. Virginia, you called on the episode of Dysfunctional Families. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I just got home from a program where at school where they teach us how to be proactive and positive, but I walk into my house with my friend and my whole entire family is just screaming. Hold on, hold on. Let me put this on speaker. Hold on. Okay, we're on speaker. Okay. Relax. Seriously, like, you need to listen to this. I've had enough of this. Well, you called on the right episode today, okay? <laughs> this is crazy, this is crazy. You know what I usually do? Because when I'm at home with my husband and my little five-year-old, yeah, we usually always, um, they always having some problems, but as long as my name isn't in it, I don't give a hand. I don't care. I usually, um, I'm in, in the house <laughs> making topics of the day. Wig I was gonna put on today, but today I don't even want to wear a wig. Like, <laughs> all right. You know what, Wendy? I mean, like, your show's cool on. Like, I guess you gave the best advice you could, but I, it's just really not gonna help me in this one. Excuse me? I'm oh, sorry, I think so. She just turned me off on my own show. <laughs> what I say goes! Oh okay? Yeah. Negative, like, activity going on, we should have to be positive, productivity, like, this is not, you know, family. You know what, Virginia? I agree. <laughs> <laughs> Who have always been there, who have made me to be successful this day. 
I am from Crash Bandicoot and Spyro the Purple Dragon. I am from Adult Blanco with Goya beans from Foyo made from Spanish ham from my, of my grandmother. I am from the most amazing person I have ever known, Jesus Christ. He is the only one who truly inspires me. He gently me to do my best at all times. He is the way, the truth, and the light. I am from humbleness and understanding. I am from respect and love. I am from make a wish or make it happen. I am from better can always be better. I am from Brookdale Hospital, Brownsville, Brooklyn. I am from my grandmother, Carmen Perez. I am from hide and seek, where six kids play every day. I am from Domino's Pizza, Spaghetti, Butter and Herb, anything Italian. I am from my son, who inspires me every day I see his face. I am from Patience. I am from Party Rock Anthem by Ella Fayo. And I am by Life is What You Make It, so you better make the best of it. I am from Guyana with my Asian Thailand heritage. I am Julie's daughter, a single mother who struggled, and Eddie, her loving brother who took care of me. I am from playing double, double dutch on Brooklyn sidewalk street, and listening to carnival music and dancing, and playing with my stuffed animals from Sesame Street. I am from homemade Thai style sweet and sour chicken with vegetable fried rice and a tall glass of iced tea. Mm -hmm. I am from my grandfather who took the gap of what a father was supposed to be. And from each and one of my family members who stood strong to fight for our country. I am from keeping my head up tall and making it work. That's by Gabriel Antonio. This is who I am. If you're going to love me and accept me, you better love me. Thank you. 
this a lot. We've done it now with the ASAC program since it began um, at Kings Road Community College. And I am so moved by the <coughs> level to which you committed yourselves to go on this journey and do it with dignity and do it with authenticity and honesty and be who you are and push yourselves further. I am so very, very impressed with every single one of you. And I'd like to come back in two years' time to your graduation and see every single one of you get that diploma with a plan to go on. Because as I think Matt said it before, we need you to be the leaders of this country. And I'm very proud of you. Thank you very, very much. On behalf of this incredible, incredible team of people, Nikari Rodriguez. Knock them dead. Knock them dead. <laughs>